incidents caught on camera involving law enforcement and the public have sparked debates on the use of excessive force. The Cedar Park Police Department hopes a new device will help them minimize force used in all cases. Today, KXN's Amanda Brandeis got a first-hand look at how it works. This is going to be the ankle strap. For officers like Robert Ducros, routine calls can turn hostile without warning. When there's intoxication involved, um, there's, there's surprises everywhere. So we asked the department to buy these devices called the wrap. It controls our use of force. Once we have the person under control, our use of force is, is, is pretty much, it ceases at that time. Once a person is wrapped, they can't hurt themselves or officers. I was able to test it out and see how it works. First, officers put on the ankle straps, which prevent the person from kicking. The second piece is for their legs, and the last is for the upper body. We'll have an officer push forward. Officer Ducrose says it's safer to restrain people upright in seating as opposed to face down. The last time that I applied it, um, that I sustained the ankle injury, um, if that would have gone on, the, I would probably escalate to a taser, a taser at that time. And it, we didn't have to go there because of this. And as tensions between police and the public remain high, simple solutions like this may help solve some complex problems. Amanda Brandeis, KXAN News. While this gear is new in Cedar Park, the wrap device was created nearly 20 years ago. The company says no deaths or injuries have resulted from its use.